Good day, everyone. Welcome to Saturday. You know, as I move through this wisdom of understanding the space of being the neutral observer, being in the space of non-judgmental energy, it requires a much more stillness in the space of awareness in the space of truly understanding how can I be neutral in my emotions when I am observing self or other people for that matter you know it is that spatial awareness of knowing that my emotions impact me my heightened emotions really impact me and how can my emotions impact another being you know it's the energy that we give off because emotions are transferable energy you know we when we cry or when we yell or scream or laugh everything that we do is contagious and transferable and yet how do we remain in our power being in the space of the neutral observer, being in the space of non-judgmental energy, when everything has the, has the potential to affect us. It is knowing what is yours, dear ones. Knowing what is your energy. And if you are allowing other energies to be contagious, to affect you, then they will. And so knowing what is yours, knowing what is your power, can fortify you against whatever, whatever it is in your field of energy and the people you surround yourself with. It is all of these things. And so, yeah, sometimes, you know, we can't help it, but things do affect us because of the heightened energy that is connected to in the streaming space, you know, just like now with the wind blowing, you know, how that energy is so high, and I am truly aware of, of this uh, nature that is called the wind, and the beauty that is the sun, and so when there's potent energies connected, it only begs for the attention, and so do we give it the attention that it's asking for? <laughs> That's it answer that you have to, that's a question you have to answer. And so when we allow ourselves to really be in the space of the observer, to really understand how our emotions react to and from someone else, it's key. Especially when we are in the space of understanding our own lives, our own actions, our own consequences for things that we've done, or things that we participated in or things that we just didn't have the strength to speak up for. But any of these things, it's how we begin to not judge ourselves for the action or lack of action that was taken. And with the understanding that we can really truly be in our power through the space of observation and only what affects us can affect us because we allow it to, once we step into that power of understanding, then, dear ones, you have truly stepped into the next phase of self-mastery. And if you wish to understand this and have this mastery of self, contact me. I'm here to be of service to you. DM me, uh, the word Lemurian for more information to see how you can get a piece of this wisdom. And I look forward to be of great service to you if your path puts you in mind. <laughs> Till next time, everyone, have a beautiful and amazing day.